Number 10. Lion. If you've ever watched The Lion King, the one who rules the land is obvious. But in the skies, the eagles take that crown. So what exactly happens when two kings go toe to toe? Eagles will definitely have the speed when in the air, but lions can be quite ferocious when you get too close. Arguably, eagles have a great disadvantage as they can't just swoop in and lift a grown mature lion off the ground. This eagle was looking out for a target on the lower ground, initially ignoring the large lion nearby. But as the lion approaches, the eagle quickly enters a defensive stance, raising its wings that span over seven feet when fully expanded. You'd think that the lion can easily go in on the offensive, especially since the eagle is not within its element, the skies. But the eagle was adamant in keeping its stance on the ground, refusing to be threatened or intimidated. With all the odds stacked against him, the eagle continued to exert its dominance as the predator. The lion could only pace back and forth, waiting for a chance to strike, which never came. Score one for the eagle. Number nine, Goose and Coots. If you've ever had the unfortunate experience of getting too up close and personal to a goose, then you're very aware of how terrifying these birds can be. Despite looking friendly, geese are massive and aggressive birds. They repel intruders and predators with their loud honking. And very surprisingly, they can have beaks that are stronger than they look strong enough to break a bone or two if you're not careful. But geese have a trait that makes them an easy target to eagles. They travel in massive groups. As soon as one goose notices an approaching eagle, they're quick to warn the rest of the flock. With their loud vocalizations, the messages spread quickly, and they move to begin their escape. But the eagle takes its time to analyze the flock, looking for any signs of weakness among them. However, the geese strategize their escape by flying closely together to form a snowstorm of geese in the sky. This confuses the eagle and greatly affects the chances of snagging a single goose in this manner. And so, the eagle moves to a quicker option. Close to the geese are a flock of coots that take a little longer to escape as they are not good flyers. Even as these coots try to escape by diving two meters deep, some are not as lucky. The eagle has sharp vision and can easily see ones hiding in shallow water. Even after a successful catch, this eagle will continue to follow the migrating flock, waiting at a fair distance for its next strike. Number 8. Seagulls. If there's one bird that comes close to geese for being loud, it'd be seagulls. Aside from being annoyingly loud, they are seen as opportunistic scavengers who will annoy the heck out of anyone close by. They are interestingly one of the rare animals who can drink salt water, thanks to a gland above their eyes that eliminates the excess salt. As seagulls are not known to be very good predators, they redirect their strategies to harass other smaller birds and steal their food. This small group of seagulls ended up messing with the wrong kind of bird though. Unbeknownst to them, they may have accidentally stumbled upon an eagle's nest. A very fatal mistake for these pirates of the sky, eagles can detect movement from up to three miles away, and it saw this arrogant seagull's actions. In a high-speed chase around this Vancouver golf course, the eagle slowly zeroes in closer to the seagull. One mistake and the seagull was down, sharp talons piercing through this thief's feathers and pinning it securely on the ground. Instead of finding a quick snack on the go, the seagull easily became lunch. Number 7. Monkey. Monkeys are known to be very playful and arrogant creatures, who take refuge within treetops where it would be difficult even for aerial invaders to spot them. They are known to have very good vision, as they can easily measure distances whenever they jump from branch to branch. However, forward-facing eyes make them susceptible to attacks from their sides. Little did they know that a harpy eagle was already nearing them, waiting for a chance to strike. Proud and carefree, the monkeys continue about their day, despite seeing the threat before them as they believed that the thick canopy would protect them from the heavy aerial attacks of the eagles. Though true, the eagle continues to observe and wait. Proud and carefree, the monkeys continue about their day, despite seeing the threat before them, as they believed that the thick canopy would protect them from the heavy aerial attacks of eagles. Though true, the eagle continues to observe and wait, seeking for one mistake to be done. And as soon as one of the younger monkeys jumps over to where they are exposed, they become instantly vulnerable. This carefree monkey could only shriek in horror as it is pinned down and lifted into the sky. Arrogance can only go so far in the face of a master predator, who is constantly looking for a meal for her nest. Number 6. Deer. Like most non-predatory animals, deer travel in groups. With speed and numbers, they can easily confuse a predator and make a harrowing escape from danger. 
but this deer unfortunately got separated from the group and strayed a little too far. This, in the eyes of an eagle, is one of the easiest catches. Wide open space in a field and a single prey in sight, the eagle moves to take action. Eagles have been found to take down deer. Their sharp talons are enough to rip through a deer's flesh within seconds, dispatching these animals with surgical precision. Although being larger than an eagle, you'd be surprised just how strong the grip strength of an eagle can be. Larger eagles can lift animals that are almost twice their size without any issue. Pierced with sharp talons, along with the damage taken from getting dragged along rough terrain, the deer could do nothing as the eagle flies off with it. Number 5. Crocodile In crocodile-infested waters, eagles such as the Philippine eagle or the harpy eagle can be commonly found waiting. When crocodiles lay eggs, they bury them in the dirt and riversides and they wait for three months before the eggs hatch. Little did this mother crocodile know that as she was hiding her eggs, an eagle had been eyeing its location. It's not uncommon for eagles to do this kind of strategy when hunting. Their eyesight is up to eight times sharper than humans. Being able to see even the most minute of details help them calculate their next move. And that next move sometimes doesn't happen for days on end. When baby crocs emerge from the nest, it's go time and the eagle doesn't waste no time to strike. The mother crocodile notices the danger and quickly rushes to pull her children into the water for safety. But even as she manages to bring a few of them to the edge, the eagle has already picked up one of the babies. The small baby crocodile that had just seen the world for a mere minute is already in the hands of this dangerous predator. But the mother crocodile is not going down without a fight. As the eagle moves across the water, she leaps into the air in an attempt to capture the invader. But alas, the eagle is swift and can maneuver itself very quickly in the air and escapes the crocodile's attack. Number 4. Sea Snake Snake Island off the coast of Malaysia is home to a multitude of snakes. Sea snakes are extremely venomous and are feared by both divers and other aquatic animals. This might be why most sea creatures leave the sea snake off their menus. Deadly as sea snakes may be, this mother eagle has hungry eaglets to feed, and it just so happens that sea snakes are their favorite. Sea snakes, unlike other aquatic animals, don't have gills. What they do have are lungs the size of their entire bodies. To breathe, they need to rise to the surface of the water which makes them very vulnerable. With very sharp eyesight, the eagle can easily see this short moment to strike. With a surgeon's precision, the eagle snatches the snake up from the water. However, the sea snake still tries to fight back. With its very potent venom, it would be easy for them to kill their assailant with one bite. But since this snake is so adapted to life in the water, it couldn't really move as well outside of it, and wasn't able to land a strike. By the time the snake is brought up into the nest, its time is over. Even the most dangerous of underwater predators stand no chance against the king of the skies. Number 3. Wallaby In high and rocky terrains, rock wallabies move quick and nimbly. They can navigate difficult terrain with expert agility comparable to mountain goats. In these parts, hiding beneath the gaps in the rock is easy to do when predators are around. Any side of movement will usually alert the group to begin finding shelter. However, this one wallaby was a little too carefree despite the warnings of others. Being unable to find cover makes their survivability rate go down as they are quite the large marsupials. This wedge-tailed eagle's lethal talons trap the wallaby to the ground, tearing down on this helpless prey. Their talons, which are significantly larger when compared to other eagles, make short work of this wallaby. Her curved beak easily breaks apart the carcass. A hunt this size is already enough to feed the entire family. Young eaglets are constantly hungry and demand food from their parents. Those who travel through these plains must beware, as these adult eagles leave no time for rest to feed their young. Number 2. Vulture Although eagles aren't very friendly with other birds, they are almost always found near another bird of prey. Vultures tend to sneak out the dead carcasses of animals left behind by their predators, which is why they are commonly seen near where eagles have previously hunted. But don't be fooled, a lot of vultures are large and equally aggressive at times. Smaller eagles can be overpowered by the larger vultures, but this doesn't stop an eagle from holding its ground. Some vultures just can't wait until an eagle has already finished feasting, even going as far as bravely attempting to snatch away an eagle's food mid-bite. But as soon as the eagle reaches out its talons, vultures are quick to back away. It's a test of patience for the vultures as they wait for their turn to feast on the remains, and also a test of patience for the eagle, who I can only assume is feeling a bit peeved about the intrusion. But some vultures just never learn their lesson. Eagles are quick on their feet and can launch into the air faster than a vulture. 
With a strong grip on the vulture's body, it is pinned down on the ground, slowly suffocating from the position. Even as they try to escape, the eagle secures their next dinner for later. Vultures need to understand that patience is a virtue. Number 1 Wolf In the mountainous parts of Mongolia, wolves remain a very real threat to the people living there. And so, the Mongolian eagle hunters specially train eagles to hunt and protect their people. These eagles navigate the skies in search of predators. Training eagles to this extent takes rigorous labor and patience, but as soon as it has learned control and discipline, it's all worth it. The wolves around this area are 5 to 8 times larger and heavier than an eagle. Hunting them is definitely not normal in other parts of the world, but for these people, it is their culture and a large part of their history and practice. Only a few eagles are chosen for such tasks, as their strength and skill are weighed heavily by the group of hunters. The slightest mistake of an eagle could prove to be lethal to them as well. The group situates themselves on a tall mountain, watching closely the movements of a nearby wolf. When the wolf has come close enough, around 500 meters or so, the hood that covers the eagle's eyes is removed. Only one is released initially to challenge and take down this beast. And as the chase begins, the wolf does its best to pick up speed and escape. But with the crushing pressure from the eagle's talons piercing through its neck, the wolf stumbles in defeat. Not even wild wolves are a match for a well-trained eagle. See you guys later.